Hi guys, we're going to show you how we went about cleaning the ethro, how do these pronounce, Indra, in, <laughs> endo bond, anyway it's the tape, but it's got the gray glue like stuff on the back of it, mm -hmm. Eterna bond, that's what it's called. This stuff is really sticky, really sticky and hard that's to get right. off. But we found by using a blower, and you can scrape it off. Use a plastic scraper. You could probably use a metal scraper. We used a plastic one just to make sure that we didn't, uh, you know, tear, scratch the, take the paint off too. Yeah. So of the, guys, of the piece. watch our video. Yes. Because we are going to share to you how, how to clean it. To clean it. Yes. And what are the things that we used it? Yeah. And so. now. We're going on to the next step. Yes. Bye. This morning we've tried to use acetone, isopropyl alcohol, and mineral spirits to clean this tape off. This is that gray sealing tape and nothing seems to be working. Nothing seems to phase it. So even scraping it just, just don't come off then it's just sticker and I'll get out so I watched a video and it said to use gasoline so I don't know about gasoline but we're gonna try it too I'm gonna I got some WD-40 here but I might just spray on it too here's some stable I just got all kind of stuff here to try. Let's spray a little bit of this on. Let's try that. Mm -hmm. Is it working? It seems to work a little bit better. Oh. Let me get another clean rag. Yeah. And maybe WD-40 is what to use. So guys, we have another technique how to get this sticky stuff, sticky off. stuff off. So we use our blower, but this kind of blower, we use this one to melt the thing and it's easy to scrape it. See? So now, oh, look at that, it see? all come right off. So it's easy, we don't need a gas anymore. And then after that, that's the time we are going to use the mineral spirits to clean it. And oh, you need a heat gun. Huh? You need one of these. Yeah, so you need a long heat gun. We tried many ways. And see, it kind of spreads it. Yeah, but it's easy to uh, to get it already. As long as it's melt. Yeah. So we are going all the way here to clean all this. See that, guys? My goodness. It's just quick. It's so easy. Yeah. So look at that now. A little bit clean, so we just need to finish this. Yeah. So this one, guys, we use this one to scrape. We try this one. We use uh, acetone. acetone. We use 
alcohol and we use the mineral spirits but we're having a hard time to get this sticker so we tried it turned about it's called it turned about it turned out what it turned about it turned about i got someone right here. okay baby. this is the white stuff that you put across to seal it and this gray is really sticky and what makes it sticky is when you press it down it activates it and becomes sticky so you peel this paper off and then put it on so that's why we have this that's why we need to get this one because we are going to change new one we're gonna put new one so we need to clean this first and so far by using this heat gun it's yeah. working And guys, have you noticed we're not using our gloves? Supposedly we are going to use gloves, but uh, it's easy if you don't have gloves because it will stick to your gloves. You're having a hard time, so we're not using gloves right now. Yeah, so it's just right now. And we use uh, rags to clean it. It's okay, it's white, so that we can see that it's already clean it. And we bought this one. Is how much is this? Like? Four dollars. It's like four dollars for eight, 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 eighteen pieces of rags. So, and mm. now you're gonna melt it again, baby. Probably. Oh, see that? It's just quick. So now, guys, you have the idea. This is the good idea. Yeah. That we are going to share it to you guys. So you don't need to buy any more gasoline if you have this heat gun. But the heat gun is like... We just bought this like a fourteen dollars, right? Yeah, harbor freight. Yeah, at the harbor freight, guys. We just bought this like a fourteen dollars, so it's worth it to buy to use this, and it's easy. So here, guys, as you can see, it's really clean now. Yeah, look at that. so look at that guys now it's clean so later we are going to use the alcohol the 70% alcohol just to get the oil of the Mineral spirit. Mineral spirit. What is that love that? So these are Tree. the things that uh, we use to clean the Trim. the sticky thing of this. Eternal bond. The eternal bond. These are the things that we use to get the eternal bond of this trim. The trim. So the you need a blower. Heater, heater blower, blower yeah. a rag and a scraper plastic plastic scraper and of course the mineral spirits so these are the only four things that you need to use to clean that trim so guys you see how we clean the trim right now so if you have questions just message us yeah. and maybe we can help you also because this is our first time this we're is our first time ever did we're before. experimenting this yeah trying to save fifteen hundred dollars labor that's, that's what they right. want to charge at the dealership that's and right we're finding out the reason it leaked poor workmanship yeah of the rb yeah so, so this that's is why a high-end our fifth wheel and I think we've been better off buying a cheap one <laughs> <laughs> so actually guys we, we are talking about the RV because we are fixing our slide out RV so we need to clean this one so guys if you like this please give us a thumbs up and if you're new to our channel please don't forget to like share and comment down below you can ask some question and see you on our next one because we have more videos about uh we are going to share also some of the videos how we fix our roof so 
Good luck to us. This is Wandering World once again. Bye.